Hey everyone, and today I'm doing an ASUS haul and try on of the things that I bought post Christmas sales. So everything that I will be showing you today is from the sales. I do these videos every year. I will leave a link down below to the one from last year. Today's haul is mainly about dresses. I really wanted some new going out dresses, dresses for going clubbing, as well as some summer dresses for any of my upcoming holiday. Some of the things that I bought, I'm really happy with and I'm so glad that I bought them. But there are some of the things that I'm not so sure about and I think I'll be returning a couple of these items. But I'm going to start with a dress that I'm really loving and I'm so glad I purchased this. I'm definitely thinking more in terms of going out and the club nights and a uni nights. It looks like this, has this beautiful navy color and this a long sleeve dress which I think is perfect for me for nights out because I always get so cold so I always have to either bring a jacket nowadays or wear something long sleeved. The material is very opaque and quite thick so it will definitely keep me warmer than most of my other dresses. Right at the bottom it has these laces, has two slits right at the bottom and has them lace details. I bought mine in the size UK 6 and just perfect size for me. This is meant to be a very tight fitting dress, slightly smarter than some of the other dresses and can definitely work for many different occasions. The only thing is it is slightly short. At the back it's fine but at the front, if I wear this dress with no tights I would have to make sure I keep pulling it down to make sure my knickers wouldn't be seen through them holes because them holes are quite high up. At the same time, I never go out with no tights on. I always wear very opaque black tights just because I always get so cold. I could not bear to go outside or go for a night out bare legs. I always have to have some really thick tights on. So that doesn't bother me whatsoever, but it is something to be wary of. I have another going out dress. This one is in this corally color. That's not my favorite. Honestly, if I could choose a different color for this dress, this next dress, I would definitely choose a different one. However, I feel like not everyone will like this dress just because of the major cutouts. On the little insets, you will see how this is meant to be looking like. It's definitely quite a brave dress because you have massive cutouts on the sides, so not everyone will like that even I feel a little too exposed in this dress and then it just goes into like a simple coral skirt type of a thing. I think I'll be able to pull it off. For the price, I think this dress was very inexpensive so I think for the price you can't go wrong with it. Again, I bought mine in the size UK 6. I'm going to move on to these shorts because I'm pretty sure I'm going to be keeping them as well. I just wish I bought UK 6, not UK 8 in these. And this could be perfect both for holiday or for going out. I think with like a fancy crop top or with like a nice sequin top, these will look perfect. They have a sheer black mesh panel on top and then this floral pattern underneath which is completely opaque so they're not see-through whatsoever thank god and they look like this from the front and like this from the back this next dress looks like this it's full of fruits you have oranges bananas apples and pears and grapes and everything you could possibly imagine and just a flowy simple black dress. I bought it in the size UK 6. I have a play suit that looks very similar to this dress so that's why I'm thinking whether I should be keeping it or not especially because the, my play suit is shorter so I prefer it a lot more but it's a play suit so ultimately it's not as risky anyway. The thing I'm definitely not keeping however is this dress that's originally from Boohoo I don't like this, sadly. I thought this would be a perfect holiday dress. I don't think they had UK 6 in stock. I think they only had a UK 8 in stock. And it's not because of the size that I don't like this. I feel like, yes, I would prefer it to be slightly tighter. But even if it, this was tighter, I would still not like it. It looks like this. I love the pattern. I love the pattern and the material. This really reminds me of that play suit I bought for Jamaica from New Look. It was also white with some floral details and it had the exact same material. And honestly, even looking at the viewfinder, 
I actually quite like this dress. That's why I'm really upset that I hate it on me. I think the sleeves are quite nice. I have laces on the sleeves and I think they look unique and flirty and girly. I think the waist, the little waistband that's here, it's way too high. It just makes my body look wrong. The waist is way too high on this dress, which is why I don't like it and I don't think I would wear this on holiday. And if I would, I feel like I wouldn't like the pictures of me with this dress on, so I'd be so annoyed with myself for wearing this and then I also bought a denim jacket that looked so stunning on the model I was so excited for it I was a lot more excited for this denim jacket than I was for anything else in this entire haul and then I got it I didn't really like the shape of it and with this one I also need to think whether I will return it or not just because I like the pattern of it so much and I really liked how it looked like on the model. So it has this sort of graffiti pattern going on. I will show you the back so you can see the pattern. And I would love this denim jacket if it was the nice shape. I know this pattern could be like a mermaid piece. Some people would love it, some people would hate it. I loved how it looked like online. But then I put it on and the fit was so boxy and I picked it up in the size UK 8. It looks a lot better if I roll the sleeves up, I have to say. If I don't have my sleeves rolled in this, I hate it. I tried it on first as it came without these sleeves being rolled up and I was like, I hate it, I'm going to return it straight away. But then I rolled up the sleeves and it looks slightly better. And then last but not least, I ordered something from my nan and this is from the plus size of a curve range. don't really know the difference between the plus size and the curve range because I never look at them because I'm neither of these things. Either way, these come in the sizes I think maybe 16 to 28. I don't know. I know for sure this dress doesn't come in my size. We ordered UK 20. It's way too big on her. If you are thinking of purchasing it, that's why I'm showing it to you. This is this has such a weird material. It's very thick and very stiff. These things go over the shoulders. They are elasticated and they're supposed to go off your shoulders. Then you have this little detail here. A zip at the back, like a little zip. And then yeah, it goes all the way up to below your knee and then you have a little slit at the back. Oh, this is from Asus Curve. So this is not from Asus Plus Size, this is from Asus Curve. We thought this would be a perfect holiday dress, perfect summer dress. When we looked at the model, she looked really like summery and just ready for any holiday. And that's why we thought, okay, this dress is perfect for holiday. But then we realized the material is not breathable at all. So I can imagine if she was to wear this on holiday, she would just sweat way too much in it. We just don't think this is very practical. We all have different styles, so perhaps you actually like some of the things that I don't really like that much. And that's great because then you can buy them for yourself. But anyway, you guys, that is the end for this ASOS haul. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you didn't, please like it and subscribe to me if you're not already. And that was my next one. Bye!